How's it hanging fellas? I'm Orosh and this is another episode of The Outer Worlds and in today's episode we're inside a cave and continuing our mission for Naoka who wants to get revenge on a Manta Queen that apparently murdered her fucking squad a couple of years ago or something and now she's really mad and she wants fucking revenge so shit we're gonna help her get that revenge and I'm not talking about the Minecraft song Nobody even fucking talks about it anymore. It was like a year ago, people were like, Oh, remember the Minecraft parodies? Of songs? And people were like, Oh yeah, that fucking... Creeper. That was a good song, man. And now no one cares again. Who the fuck cares about fucking memes? Nobody does. Memes are garbage. Every single one of them. I fucking hate them. I fucking hate memes? And uh, that's it. That's all I want to say. I fucking hate memes. What are the enemies here? What are these fucking things? I don't know what this is. But it's dead now. Look, fucking skeletons. What is this, like, multiple objectives I have in here? Oh, a pistol. Alright, in today's episode we're gonna have to go back to Byzantium and I have a feeling that coming back to that place will have a little bit of a problem. Well, I forgot to reload my gun. Spot. You know, I thought I'd be angry. I thought I'd storm in here in a rage and exterminate all these bugs and everything would be alright in the end. But it's not. I ain't. I'm mostly just empty. A little sad maybe. Yeah, me too. First night yeah, I was like nice re-watching. We knew it was home. Safe. Uh, shit. Got a nice chill to it. I was like rewatching my old Let's Plays and I sounded way more it. cheerful and like, How's the hanging brothers or shit? We're gonna do this cool stuff now and... Man, I just don't wanna talk like that. Monarch folks often joke about it. Maybe it's me, the, Not of me the smell or the becoming more fucking grumpy and sick of everything. Or maybe it's me just there's no not feeling like it's I should pretend and to be excited about everything. About or maybe it's just me getting more comfortable Somehow about sitting here moved. all by myself and talking to myself. The nights we spent in here felt like vacations. You so built all this? We hauled in steel. Hired sublight folk to help. That's how we met Anders and Opal. They stuck around after our contract was up. I watched Opal another camping. loop in the third Anders movie. Liked chasing her tail. Yes, of course I did. Four I watched them like every day. Scraping together this one was something Alcatraz. I forgot what it was called. This was Rebecca. not a new one. It was a, one of the old survivors. ones, I believe, for on season two. So Lupin had a red suit. And Clara, her little sister. I'll admit I wasn't keen on taking her on at first, but for a teenager, she had a head for numbers. Helped us trade hides mm -hmm. for food and materials. Negotiate yeah, contracts. Shut up! I was about to tell Turned people to be story. Useful. Clara, Hayes, Anders, Rebecca. Some Opal fucking asshole named Henry. fucking Logan is keep Six asking folks, me in the comments. Name. We wanna be friends? He's probably not even a real person Carol. though. Despite Monarch trying to kill Checked us out his channel, he has nothing out. on it. He left wrong. like only four comments total all f on my channel. So he's a fucking bot. Me too, Captain. I'm pretty sure. But pretty much only people that comment on my videos are bots. Now let's get to shooting Nobody before I get all Nobody fucking cares about me. I don't care about mind. anyone either. So I'm a badass. Where are you guys going? I can collect dirt plants. I don't know why the fuck I, why I do that. You guys like take care of the Manta Queen? Bad, huh? Wrong man. Oh, never mind. She got it. Kind of. Not the way I thought she would. I have to come into action. Yeah, we got it. And I can take... Where... Oh no, don't tell me it broke. I did it. And this one was even... Full of cool stuff. Yeah, it's interesting that, like, in Skyrim, the biggest fucking, like, richest items are usually, like, dragon bones and dragon scales. 
And then this game doesn't have dragons, but they're like manta queens, and they seem to have like shit on them. And I don't even bother to collect it. This reminds me of that uh, of that area in Monster Hunter World, where I was finding Diablos, I think it was called. I wish these were more auspicious circumstances, but I was like, oh man, this is here. gonna suck. This is this like a really tough monster. Together. And then I beat Bearing it first try. This is the kind of thing Hayes would have done. That makes it stupid. By all accounts, we should have left well enough alone, but that also makes it right. Captain. You're so, welcome. Do you mind if we rest a spell before we head out? I'd, I'd like to bury Opal and Clara proper. All right. We, what? Why? Those painful memories, Captain. I don't know. Huh. That's... That ain't a bad point. All right, Captain. Thanks. See, everybody loves me. Except Parvati, because he killed her boss and she was like all freaked out. What the fuck I done? Alright, a bunch of weird transitions between locations. Which I could have easily done by just walking towards them. Ah, but whatever. Yes, yeah, so in that one, Lupin. What the fuck does he do? Like. Zenigata is pretty confident in that one. He actually manages to stop Lupin from stealing the money at the beginning. And he actually arrests him for once. He actually does that. Except then later he finds out that one of the the, the bad guy of the movie, who's like some asshole who fucking tried to cover up the JFK assassination, that's seriously what the movie's about. He uh, he pretends to be Zenigata's partner at the beginning, but you kind of fucking know that it's, it's probably gonna be a bad guy. Every time Zenigata has a fucking partner, they're usually like actually relevant to the story. It's not just some asshole who just tags along. Except that one time when he actually did hit some asshole who tagged along, and he was actually fucking awful. It's the worst character, and. And there was a fucking stupid thing, I guess, how they reveal, like, you know, I don't know, foreshadow that he's the bad guy? The bad guy did a fucking weird thing when you first see him, like, walking into his fucking room full of other bad guys. There was, like, multiple bad guys. It's weird because this movie, like, doesn't follow the formula of, like, Lupin, where there's, like, a bad guy and a henchman. This one had, like, a couple of bad guys, and the henchman were kind of absent from the movie, really. And they weren't working for the bad guy, they were like... CIA agents. So not only they tried to kill Lupin, they also tried to kill the bad guy too. So it's kinda weird. Also the bad guy and the, the henchmen, I called them Blues Brothers, because that's what they looked like. So yeah, Blues Brothers were the henchmen of that movie. Italian game here, fucking James Bond and Alcatraz, whatever. Hit fucking Blues Brothers. I actually meant to watch Blues Brothers because I remember when I was a kid and I was watching Drake and Josh a lot, they would mention Blues Brothers a lot. And I was always like, what the fuck is Blues Brothers? I never heard of, of anything like that. I never seen it, uh, but I know it's a really old movie and I don't think I'll like it. I don't know, I, I don't really fucking feel like watching it. And, um... What the fuck was my point? I forgot. My point was... Oh yeah, that there were the henchmen. The bad guy walks into like a conference room and he has like fucking chestnuts in his hand for some reason. And he has them solely just to like get mad later and crush them with his bare hand. Just to show you, like, oh man, he's so mad. And then later, the, the Zenigata's fucking partner shows up, and he has nuts in his hand, believe it or not. And it turns out that, oh man, he's evil, he's the bad guy. Mr. Robot, can you, like, tell those two people that I'm actually not a bad person? Alright, right, I guess I have to kill everyone here. I feel like I might have fucked up the whole game, actually. Look, everybody wants me dead now. And you know what that means? 
I'm gonna walk into the city and fucking kill everyone. Hope you're ready for a mass fucking murder because I sure wasn't. I had not planned this. Nice music. All right, let's get to work. If I spit, I, I, can hit that I would love to go to the city without having to murder everyone, but uh, they're not leaving me much choice. Well, they attack on sight. I can't even negotiate or anything. Maybe if I murder all of the guards in the city, they will just fucking leave me alone. Yeah, this sounds like there's something they should do. Board's not gonna like me about this, but I don't really give a shit whether they like me or not. Run, civilians. Get the safety because I'm a crazy person. I think the civilians are marked as enemies too now. Seems like civilians even turned on me. Can I like return this garbage I had to return to the lady? I got your stuff. Oh, it's not going very well. And it's all because of that stupid mission where I had to kill a lady. But what was I supposed to do? It's not like I wanted them to kill me. Oh my god, I'm just gonna murder like everyone in the city. Oh, I kinda know what to do. How can I calm them down? I'm gonna look something up pretty quickly. Ah, uh, this is the item I had to interact with. But it doesn't seem like I can interact with anything. Since everybody wants me dead. They don't want me dead anymore. Look, they're fine with me. Walking around. Just these stupid soldiers. They're fucking assholes. There's two of them in this place. No. Don't shoot me. Don't kill her, guys. Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? You killed the... the lady I was supposed to bring the items back to. You guys are the worst. I can't believe you've done it. Oh, I'm really fucked now, man. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. I really, really screwed up, okay. It's not what I was supposed to do. This isn't good. When is this nice last save from? Can I see. If it's before I started murdering everyone, then I'm gonna find... Is there any way to make them calm? Can I like sneak around? Maybe I can like sneak into this place. Fuck. I'm really fucked now. I'm genuinely fucking fucked right now. Oh my fucking god, I don't know what to do. Oh my god, okay, I'm gonna look up if I can, like... Is there any way to calm everyone down? Oh, this is ridiculous. There has to be a fucking way. They can just fucking let me just... Not finish two quests. Oh jeez. 
Jesus Christ, why is everyone so fucking loud? I fucking hate when everyone has to stand outside the fucking room being loud and just fucking piss me off and I don't even care if they hear me. I don't fucking care. I'm gonna pause the video here. Okay, I found one way to reset Byzantium, I mean, board reputation. So apparently the reason they want to kill me is because my reputation with the board is so low, they just, they just want to fucking kill me. And Byzantium is unfortunately run by the board, so everyone in here wants me dead. But uh, there's a quest apparently, I didn't know about it. And it's a quest after you complete a... Qu I looked something up about when you complete a mission like City in the Skies or something like that. Then you can talk with Ada and then some board executive will contact you to put a plug on Phineas' computer. But you can actually change it for not fi Okay, Ada, do you have like an info for me? Welcome back, Captain. How can I be of assistance? What part of the colony would you like to discuss? Ah, yes. As Dr. Wells is a wanted outlaw, he built his laboratory. How can I be of assistance? Goodbye. Mm. Doesn't seem like she has that. Oh, there you go. That's the... <laughs> That's the quest. Fuck. Okay, let's try and do that, okay? Let's try and complete this. But maybe I can sneak through. I wish there was like a stealth boy, like in Fallout, where you can put a stealth boy and the guards won't fucking see you because you're invis invisible. Well, it doesn't seem to work in this game. I mean, there's nothing like that. Shit. What the fuck will I do now? You know what's one thing I don't like in this game? It's how every company has like the same style of this like fucking 50s advertisement. It's like all fancy and shit. Maybe it's like, I don't know fucking what time period it's from, but and every company has the same style and look. They're not very different. You may not even realize that they're those are different companies at first glance. Okay, I'm gonna try to sneak around. Maybe I can get to that office and talk with the man. Well, I'm afraid I'll have to fucking walk right into a fucking office full of soldiers and they'll fucking blast me on sight. Maybe I can sneak through. Definitely not going to the lady with the clothes store because there's like two soldiers standing in there. Why? I don't know what they, what they would do that, but they are. Maybe what also lowered my reputation with the board is that I would keep stealing shit from, her, from them. And telling them that oh, I didn't do anything. Okay, there's two guards to the left. Now how can I make it all the way there? Look, I gotta somehow... Oh fuck, I wish I had like guards marked on the map. Gotta make it all the way there. This ain't gonna work. Okay, I think I'm pretty fucked, you know? I think there's like no fucking way of me recovering from this shit. I only wish they weren't showing so many Spacer's Choice ads in the commercial breaks. Who do they think their audience is? Okay. I wasn't spotted. Thank god that game actually bothers to show me where the enemies are. Wait, I didn't kill this... ...person. I feel like Naoka killed them when I was like running away from this place a couple of episodes ago. Oh, maybe they did get into a fight and I didn't notice. Okay, there's no bridge this way though. So maybe I better go this way. Ah, oh, 
this shit is complicated, man. How do I get on that bridge? I ever tell you about this one patient? One that her eyebrows moved up and the tip of her nose raised. Oh no. Why? Was she trying to disguise herself? Was she on the run or something? So she'd always be looking down on everyone. You are making that up. Making stuff up is work. This is real. <laughs> this is not good. Oh, it's not good one bit. In this city work anymore. I can pickpocket people, but I never carry to. Oh, what's this? It's like someone has a puppy. It's a bit like a scary alien. Yeah, I don't think it's worth pickpocketing people in this game. Doesn't teen life seems awful cushy. Could get myself used to kicking back for a spell. Like one of the ways I was it's looking up one time. And stuffy parties where everyone Wait, am I like really wanted dead because and Naoka and Ellie were walking sounds. around fucking I'm murdering me. everyone? Not when What do you think? No, Finch, fuck you. Sorry for the I swear to God, you have to fucking put your nose in everything. Fucking bitch. Maybe I can get by. Okay, that's a great jump. Thank God for those shitty helmets where they can't see me. Oh, never mind, never mind. I take it all back. I take everything I ever said about this. The guards in this game back. At least the robbers don't try to kill me. That's nice. Well, maybe I should have done this quest before I done any of these assassinations I was supposed to do. Look, I ain't gonna reload. Maybe I will. So I'm kind of fucked. I, don't, I can't even get to that place. There's guards in the way. Maybe if I could like get a sneak attack on them. I don't think there's a. I don't think there's such a thing as sneak attacks in this game. Anyone else noticed? Yes, everyone noticed. They have like keys. They did. Okay, let's get in. Maybe they won't try to kill me inside. What's with the music? It's fucking weird. Oh, brother, brother, brother! This is not what the fuck I meant to do. Well, I kinda knew I'm gonna get fucked. Oh no. I did a board. Can I like... Take your best shot, oh, for fuck's sake. Are we really gonna kill all of them? Now they're gonna be willing to negotiate. Maybe the person didn't hurt anything. Sounds stupid, but you know, we met a lot of people that didn't hurt gunshots when they were like happening next to me. How did you get in here? Haven't you heard the gunshots? You! You just slaughtered those guards, and for what? To speak with me? What could possibly be so urgent? I want to get on board so good side this again. Is one of the guys who runs the colony, huh? Small room for a big shot. If this is about another aether wave clip or radio spot, you may kindly fuck off, as the parlance goes. I'm not <laughs> doing any more. Uh, cut the crap. I'm here for. I don't know what I'm oh, here for. Of course. 
What else would it be? I don't have any drugs. You should try a vending machine or a purveyor of curative goods. I don't know if our chemicals are here, but this guy is definitely not. Will that be all then? I need some specific oh, drugs. I don't think I can say this any more slowly. Of course, of course. It's Rockwell again. Who else? And I thought he was only holding me here to keep me out of the way. Chairman Rockwell locked you up in you here. You are a quick study, indeed. I've long suspected Rockwell of transacting business in my name, but this proves it. Yeah, sure. It's always someone else who ordered the hookers and energizing ointment. Please, this is important. Whatever it is that brought you here, Rockwell's the one behind it. Then I'll have to deal with him. Whatever Rockwell's doing, he'll be doing it from the HHC headquarters. Your best lead is to look for details in his office. This colony's problems have always seemed to trickle down from the top. We're set on fixing Halcyon. That's as good a place as any to start. Exactly. And fix it we must. We really gonna do this? Getting involved is a messy business, and it rarely pays. This is about more than bits. This is about the survival of the colony. If you don't help, who will? Will this, like, Why, finish this the quest? Why this sound like an issue of Dissident Hunter? Okay. Via the Acropolis district, of course. That's where the most important corporate and government facilities are. But only board employees are and allowed to investigate the, the office. There's a heavily guarded checkpoint just down the street. There might be a route through the maintenance tunnels, but I'm afraid I don't know specific. Yeah, I'm going to kill good, everyone. Because there are sure to be more at headquarters. When you reach the HHC building. I'm on wait. my way. To Rockwell has one of the only terminals capable of transmitting to the earthbound message drone. This is our chance. Please, take this and transmit it from his office. Rockwell hasn't given me any messages from Earth for years. He's desperate to keep me out of contact with the Earth Directorate. I'm not... But they need like to not know kill what's citizens. Happening. Okay, you can count on me. Halcyon is in dire... It's definitely in a dire need of murderers, just like me. Oh, fuck, it's just some guards. Who the fuck even cares about their lives? Nobody does. I could steal their shit while I'm at it. While I'm already stealing their fucking lives. Ah, oh, shit ain't going too good. What else about that movie I was ta just talking about? Lupin, shit. Hmm. I really like the ending. There weren't so many annoying characters like the Italian game. There were Blues Brothers. I really like the idea of JFK assassination actually having something to do with the plot of that movie. And I actually didn't know about the whole mystery of how Alcatraz is actually a cover cover up for like a city underground. Unless they made it up. Which I guess they could. It's a movie. You could make anything up. Maybe JFK assassination never happened, and it's just all a loop in the third fucking plot point. I don't know. Oh, those are dead. What happened to him? Uh, this lady, for example. Oh, I got some terminal codes. Who killed this lady? I'll see you. Yeah, I don't think it was her. I don't think it was some innocent lady that mm -hmm. had nothing to do with this. Something's not right. Here they come! I didn't die. I'm here to meet the headquarters president. None of you motherfuckers better stand in my way. What I want to do something. Actually, no. I was gonna go and kill early parents, but I don't really care. What's that noise? Okay, maybe I'm gonna take cover. Oh, 
No, 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 they're dying. They're like blowing up. You kind of asked for it. I was willing to actually go to prison or pay for my reputation when I got here, but no, you had to shoot me on sight. And this is what you get. Just back to peaceful music. This game's music is not really special. Just generic, I don't know. Not to say that Fallout's like ambient music was really good, but like the music on the radios was good. I guess the music on elevators in this game is also really good. Like not really good, but it's a cool elevator music. I'm some weird person who likes elevator music. Sounds relaxing. I guess these episodes are gonna make up for any episode that was boring before. Gun blazing is my character trait. I guess it fits my roleplay that I would do something like that. Jeez, Jimmy Bob. Fuck, I gotta roleplay at GZB again. I mean, that's been a while. Oh shit! Oh, that was like a lot of them. President? You okay, you're right. I lost a lot of ammo on this. It's locked. It's locked, but for how long is it gonna be locked? Somebody has to fucking better let me in. Tell me I screwed up again. How do I get in? Oh, there you go, I got a key. And there's a hole in the wall? Just goes to show you never really see your hometown till you travel with a visitor. Okay, I did something. Good afternoon. I'm Chairman Rockwell, and I'm here to address a serious issue facing us. As you all know, our colony has been successful beyond our wildest dreams. Unfortunately, we've recently discovered that our food supply will not be able to sustain Halcyon's population in the long term. Everyone will die. How nice. Everyone will slowly stop living from malnutrition. But we're doing it together. And that's what matters. Like the bloopers? If someone doesn't give you something to read that will placate the masses soon, all of you will find yourselves violently unemployed. But I can assure you there's nothing to fear. We've got a solution. It's called the Lifetime Employment Program. We will freeze most of the colony to preserve resources, while the best and brightest of Byzantium continue living in prosperity. Look, you idiots! How many times do I have to tell you we can't say shit like that? Fire whoever wrote this! Why would While you say Hell's that? Brightest minds solve the problem of our so why shortage, I get to watch this? The rest of the colony will Loopers? Be in suspended animation. Individuals will be revived on a rotating basis so that every Halcyonite can be part of the important work of saving our colony. By testing like... paperweights. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know. Let, but let's go again. And someday, in the Just not paper words. Can you shut up? I don't crisis. care. We'll Alright, I don't know what the fuck I achieved. I don't know about you, but I'm all for living fast and dying young. Uh, wasn't I supposed to... Like, 
get something done here? Sealed. What the fuck you mean sealed? Is there like a door? What I was supposed to do? That's a cool view actually. Man, this ant seems bigger than I thought. It's not even a door. It's not even real. Should I maybe hack it with the computer? What's this? A broken snow globe. Should bring it to Mr. House. No, I already watched it. Okay, what is my... My skills? I can max out my handguns. And I can... Whatever this is. Alright, what do I have to do? Retrieve the domain, uh, you learned it, blah blah blah. Okay, well, what do I do now? Guess I go down. I don't like how I did this, to be honest. Just brute force my fucking way into this place. I don't like it, you know? Oh, look, it's see. Oh, shit. I already had a glimpse of what's about to happen. More shooting! Maybe he's here to talk to me. You think? Yeah, actually, they don't seem to care too much. Why is it yellow when I point it at him? Oh, that's not what I'm supposed to do. I think I'm supposed to go back to the guy I was just speaking with. Okay. Okay, let's do it quick. Let's do it quickly. Because, fuck, I'm really confused as to what I'm supposed to do. I really don't like the fact that everybody wants me dead here. But from what I heard, if I finish this quest, then uh, the board will call me on my ship. They will offer me to betray Phineas. And what I can do is tell Phineas about them trying them trying to get me to betray him. And we will fuck over the board, but I'll get the respect back to zero. So I think that means I can still walk around Byzantium and no one will fucking shoot at me. Which is cool. Which is fine. I would really like that. I would love nothing more but for them to fucking fuck off and leave me alone. Like, I didn't have to do that. I'm a one-man army. I can fucking take on anyone. Yo, what the fuck? What, what did I just found? Oh, I thought I found, found like a special gun. That i never seen before. Someone's leg fell off. This game could be so brutal, but it just doesn't fucking do anything about it. It was like one messed up place in the whole game with the cannibals. It's like the pets are trying to kill me. Where am I supposed to go? Nah, this episode's not good, man. Shit's going south really quickly. I've been sitting here for a while now. Office clerk, office clerk. I guess they're just supposed to go here. And I guess I'm supposed to get into even more gunfights. It's not good, man. It's not good. What's today? Wednesday. Nothing. I don't think I have anything to do, to be honest. Which means I could probably... What's that fucking movie that I was talking about? Maybe, maybe, maybe I could. Maybe I could, maybe I can't, who the fuck knows anymore, I don't know. I was watching the behind the scenes commentary of Half-Life VR with Selfware AI. It's such a long title. That was, oh my god, there's a lot of these guys. Guys, 
Just give up. Don't fucking get through me. Okay, you go. I ain't gonna kill innocent people for no reason. I can kill innocents when they give me a reason. It's kinda cool to see all these people run in fear. Alright, Ellie got. Ellie fucking got this. Thank god they're not killing c civilians. That would kinda suck if they started killing everyone, including civilians. I think that made this game a little more exciting. We never had a shootout like this. Like city guards. It's pretty messed up, actually. But I got myself involved in shit like this. Wasn't supposed to go that way. Look, I think this is entirely their fault because they refuse to fucking listen to me and fucking stop. I'm gonna hack this, maybe that will actually help me. Look, they don't even care that I just killed all the guards. They're just back to their usual business of just sitting here. Oh, I got the cloaking ability now. Ain't it a little bit late for cloaking ability now? Everybody wants me dead anyway. Oh my god, look at the amount of red things. Eh, whatever. I'll fucking kill them all. I ain't afraid to pull the trigger. Where the fuck am I going, though? Oh, law. What did they take for? I'm really, really still hoping I can turn this around and... Where am I supposed to fucking go? Oh, maybe this way. There's like a door. Ooh, what'd you find? Never mind, there's nothing there. I mean, there is stuff there, but I don't fucking care about it, God damn it! Oh, there was an elevator, never mind. Guess I'm a dumbass. Maybe with the cloaking ability they will actually not fucking try to kill me. We're going deep undercover. Don't worry, don't worry, it'll be fine. There's no more need for bloodshed. Right? Yeah, there is need for bloodshed, but I'll try to go fucking like. Keep your eyes out for visitors. Keep your eyes out for visitors. Like that murderous son of a bitch who killed my fucking family in a fucking shootout in the middle of the street. I hope they don't mind that I'm just walking in. As if it's nobody's business. There we go, I found the place. I know I ran out of my cloaking ability, but if you know, then I get three tries with this whole thing. They spot me and they all be like, what the fuck am I doing here? I can just be like, oh nothing, and then I'll reset. Okay, I got this thing. What do I do about it? Transfer to canister. Transfer 100%. Why would I fucking not transfer all of it? Oh, what's happening? Are you guys suffocating? Ah, oh, too bad. I don't really give a shit about anyone's life at this point. It's a little too late giving a fuck, you know. Now I'm just gonna walk out. Walk out with my cock out. I don't even know which way no I'm going. No visitors allowed. Sure. I've heard that one before. 
Lost Emus. Just don't let You got it. You got it, bro. Which way was the exit? Fuck, I genuinely forgot which way was the exit. Like, maybe this way I can get to the exit? No. This doesn't feel like I'm getting closer to the exit. Fuck, that's not good. There's the elevator, okay. Yeah. I think it did pretty fine. I just have to go back to Phineas and finish the stupid episode. The stupid episode full of murder and, and blood and just all fucked up shit. At least it adds to Jeez, I mean Jimmy Bob's character, you know. Because next time I'm gonna use him, you can keep in mind that he was responsible for like the massacre in fucking Byzantium. Alongside Ellie and Nyoka. But who the fuck cares about companions in RPGs? They're like saints, they can never do anything wrong. It's not their fault. After all, they're, ju they're just following me. So it's my fault that there are no murderers. Because I killed a science lady and apparently it lowered my fucking reputation in this city so bad that now everyone wants me dead. Which is kind of a bummer. Kind of a bummer drummer, you know? You know what I'm talking about? You don't? Okay. That's too bad then. I'm disappointed that you don't know what I'm talking about. At least the robots don't give a shit. That's nice. Can I teleport and finish this episode because I'm sick of it? I'm unable to teleport. Okay, going back to the other one. Run as the wind. Maybe I could just murder everyone in this place. Look, I already murdered so many guards, it doesn't seem like there's many guards left anyway. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill them all. Citizens, you run home. Yeah, that's so I can't blame you. Stop running into my... Nice people want to fucking die, I guess. Okay, you're lucky you're not dead. You guys finish them off, I'm gonna run away. You guys are doing great. Shit went south. Shit went every direction. At least it feels like the end of the game, I have to go through like hordes of fucking guards because they're assholes and they just fucking refuse to get the fuck out of my way. We're going to the ship, finish the episode, figure out how the fuck I can reset this thing. If it's even still possible. Maybe it would be possible if I haven't fucking actually murdered all of them. over it by just stealing all this shit and selling it. Are we fine? If I think we... F hey, what's up? They don't seem to mind. Let's just uh, get out of here. I'm surprised they will just allow me to fly out of this place. Even
even though I murdered everyone. I murdered like a lot of people. I don't care. I fucking asked for it. I would have murdered them if they were willing to listen. I was willing to go to jail. But wait out this whole fucking... All these crimes I've committed. No, they fucking had to go ahead and start shooting. Now I gotta finish this damn episode before it gets too fucking long. Cause I've been sitting here for a while. Okay. I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do. Welcome back. Do wipe the blood and space dust from your feet in the entry bay. Thank you. We're still doing this. I have to return to Phineas. Oh my god. Parvati, thank god you didn't went with me because I think you'd get a fucking heart attack. I can't prepare them. <clears throat> Alright. See you fans in the next episode. Bye.